Uh, today uh, sees the anniversary of the bombing of Hiroshima and in August we also saw the uh, bombing of uh, Nagasaki 70 years ago. A few weeks ago I was in Nagasaki and I laid a wreath on behalf of the Scottish Government in memory of the lost souls of Nagasaki. And 70 years on it's very important that we remember the, the sheer horror and atrocity of the impact and effect that the dropping of the atomic bombs had on the peoples, the cities, the, 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 the vibrant cities that were no longer um, after that horrific bombing event. In terms of where we are now today, particularly in the 70th anniversary, it's very important we remember the people. There are arguments over history and have been for 70 years, and there are arguments now for and against nuclear weapons. The Scottish Government stands firm in our opposition to nuclear weapons. Uh, for many people we share the view that they are immoral, but for many people also they recognise now that in terms of military aspects, in terms of the economics of the renewal of Trident, that a hundred billion pound cost uh, for renewing a weapon of mass destruction is not acceptable in economic or military terms. So we're here today to lay petals on the, the waters outside the Scottish Parliament to remember the souls of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. But for politicians and for the Scottish Government, we will always stand, stand firm in our opposition and make that case. 